And we now have two persistent weak layers that we're paying attention to here. You still have that really weak sugary junk down on the near the ground or two or three feet deep that we've seen pretty big avalanches triggered on in the last couple weeks breaking breaking wide and we can still trigger avalanches breaking on that weak layer and now we have a layer of surface hoar buried here it's just about three inches deep and it's not quite deep enough to be propagating or creating avalanches but when we get more snow which is expected tomorrow or where this has a little bit of a wind load on it we'll start to see avalanches so because we have this junk at the ground our best travel advice is to stay off the steep slopes and out from underneath them. Um, if we start to feel better about that, we still need to be looking for this surface or as we get more snow. So digging pits to track those weak layers and test their stability is a good start and then managing terrain cautiously.